So guys, this video is going to be very interesting if you are using Windows 11 or you are planning to use Windows 11 because in this video, I'm going to show you the amazing features of Windows 11. And after that, you are definitely going to install Windows 11 if you are using Windows 10 because this is amazing. Okay, so let's see what are the new features in Windows 11 and how you can use them. So basically, this video in detail, I'm going to tell you each and everything. Okay, so first amazing feature is related to voice typing. This is an amazing feature if you are a blogger or you want to type anything without using your hand then you can use this voice typing okay so for enabling that you just need to press window plus H key so it will enable but it is saying you need to select the text box so where I'm going to type it so basically I have opened this here now just press window plus H key again and it will enable and now whatever I'm typing it is going to type here without using my keyboard so if you like this feature so I would suggest hit the like button on my video and if you are new then do subscribe so now you can see it typed this paragraph in a just fraction of second so basically it depends upon you how clearly you speak uh, while using this feature so this is the first amazing feature you can use it for your work or your productivity and the next amazing feature which is really new nobody knows this okay because this is in beta channel so what it is it is voice access right this is going to be game changing in windows 11 so go into accessibilities and here you need to go into this speech and here you can see voice access feature so basically just turn it on here you can see this mic just enabled okay so basically you just need to click on this mic and now open chrome open microsoft edge open microsoft store minimize microsoft store so that's how you can use this amazing voice access feature in Windows 11. If you want to close it, you can just uh, click here, turn off. Okay, so that's how you can use it. You can use it from the start of your system. Okay, so you have to set it here like this setting, set start voice access after you sign in. Okay, so this is the second amazing feature you can use. And the most lovable feature in Windows 11 is Android apps. They have announced Android apps for Vita version. I already took how you can install these Android apps so you can use it very easily so you can see I already have Android apps here you can open this Instagram app so you can play Android games here as well it uses Windows subsystem for Android which is the kind of virtual machine so on that basis it is running so here you can see Instagram Android apps on my Windows 11 so it's working perfectly fine here so there is no issue with that so using this Aurora store you can install any app like uh, Google Chrome or Instagram WhatsApp Facebook Netflix PayPal whatever you want to use you can use it if you want to play big games like PUBG New State and Free Fire so you can watch my previous videos you will be able to understand how you can install these Android apps on Windows 11 right so this is going to be game changing in Windows 11 and the next amazing feature which you already have seen like new settings app so here you can see the complete UI experience is going to change if you are going to see this settings app basically in the left side you can see all the main settings like system Bluetooth and network so you can switch between settings very very easily or very quick right if you want to access the internet settings so you can click here and in the right side you have all the related setting to internet okay and the same like apps so you can click here installed apps so you can see all the installed apps so this is an amazing change in settings app and here you can see you can click on windows update so you can see the complete ui change for update section as well and the next amazing feature windows 11 themes so go here in personalizations so here you can see the new themes so you can choose whichever you want like this and you want to choose this one its name is glow with four images set here windows dark theme windows light theme so basically it depends upon you which one you like you can set here and the next feature is a start menu you can see the new start menu so basically all the live tiles are just gone and here you can see all the pinned app so you can pin any app which you like most pin to taskbar unpin from a star insert you can see instagram so just uh, pin this app on a start so basically it is going to pin here okay so that's how you can do and then the bottom side you can see a recommended section so whatever you have recently used that is going to show you here and in start menu you can see type here 
here to search okay so basically you can open search from here very easily and the next feature is related to new taskbar so you can see all the icons in center and uh, you can move these all the icons in the left side as in windows 10 okay so if you want to move in the left side you can just right click on taskbar settings and uh, go into this uh, taskbar we have here and here you will see center alignment or left alignment so that's how you can move it and at the same time i just want to tell you you can see the animation as well you will see animation everywhere right so that makes windows 11 very beautiful right and there is a, some little issue like you can't move this taskbar to left right top anywhere but you can do with the registry hack you can customize your taskbar by here like taskbar item if you want to set your search icon here and if you want to hide so you can switch these settings off and on and the next feature is new desktop here you can open as many multiple desktop you want okay so let me tell you how you can use it and increase your productivity like you can set your one desktop for your gaming or for your entertainment change the name like desktop 2 you can right click and name here music or entertainment whatever you want and you can change the wallpaper of this desktop like you can see here choose the background So like you can see I set these two wallpapers here for music there is another wallpaper and for desktop one there is another wallpaper okay so you can play around this new feature and there is another new feature is widgets so here you can see widget section just click on it and you can press window plus w key to open these widgets so you can see your weather widgets and if you want like a small so you can set it like this so you can click here and you can add widgets like family safety to do traffic esports entertainment all these widgets are here so you can click and add like uh, entertainment okay so it will add so basically all these widgets contents sync with your microsoft account so you have to first login and after that you can see here so you can remove widgets like this and you can drag and drop like this okay so basically you can customize according to you scroll down to the bottom you will see all the news content related to your interest so this is a new feature in that there is another new feature is chat app so you can press window plus c key to open this chat app so i can't show you my details here because i use it for chatting with my friends so you can call you can video call or you can just uh, chat by just clicking on any friend and you can type anything so you can directly chat like this you can call so this is a good app for teams user so whenever you get any notification you will see here badge icons on the taskbar right and you can just click on this open microsoft team so it will open the complete app for you and here you can see notification activity mentioned activity and chats and calendar here so whatever the event you have set for that particular date you can manage from here it have lots of things so if you are a team user you will understand very easily right so this is a new thing they have added in this windows 11 feature next feature is new file explorer experience open this file explorer you can see the complete new ui and rounded corner on the action center you will see here lots of icons like cut copy paste rename sort so all these things are here just change view you will see here new context menu so all these things are changed click on any drive you can see some extra padding between the folders so it's look pretty cool here there's a new icon in that you can see videos new icon pictures music all is here new another most interesting feature people are mostly using it for their productivity like if you have multiple monitors or or big monitor screen then you can use this snap layout feature right so like you open this file explorer here you open this microsoft store microsoft edge and google chrome all right so now you want to snap these snapping is like you can split the screen you can press window plus z key to active this snap layout or you can just hover here so you will get this okay so like you can click here and in the right side what you want to set I want to set this Microsoft Store so like this and if you want to group more apps so you can again click here snapping whichever you want like uh, I want this one which one you want to set here this file explorer and uh, this one and here this one now 
all fours are here and there is another feature i just want to tell here snapping group layout okay so minimize this window window plus d and here you can see your microsoft store and here you can see group snapping is also here so you can click here so you can use your this app from here you can just click on groups so you can see all your four groups here so if you have big monitor screen so this will be a game changing for you like you want to watch youtube videos at the same time you want to do something in your right side so you can use this snap layout so this is the most interesting and usable feature people are using it and enjoying it there is another new feature or you can say new app which is microsoft store the complete new ui for this microsoft store you can see so whenever you click on any apps you will see here some animation for that right like i want to open this you can see the little animation and the complete ui experience is going to change for this new microsoft store app there is some new shortcut key for this windows 11 like you want to press window plus s key to open search window plus a key to open action center and if you want to open chat so window plus c to open chat window plus z to active the snapping layout window plus w to open widget section and there's another new feature is lock screen so here you can see new lock screen time in a center all things are clean so these are the new features in windows 11 till now and in future they are going to add many more i hope you like this video so just hit the like button and do subscribe if you are new on this channel so okay guys thank you so much for watching this video